Dig it, my friends. It's me. It's Ken. We're doing that. Here's some Ken thing here at the Toy Insiders Holiday of Play. And we're going to learn about all the awesome stuff that learning resources and their companion brands have going on at the event. And the awesome Macy Pritchard is going to help me figure it out for the most part. Yeah. How are you, Macy? What's going on? I'm doing good. I'm having a good time at the show. Um, we've got a lot of great stuff, so I'm happy to give you a little tour of everything we've got. Yeah, let's do a tour. Let's do awesome. a tour. Okay, so first we're going to start off with learning resources. So this is a 40-year-old educational toy brand. Um, they're in classrooms. They're meant to be a resource for parents, educators, and caregivers alike to foster essential skills in young ones. So right now, our big holiday item is going to be the Prep and Store Kitchen Island. It's here. Oh, yes. wow. So this retails for $64.99. You can find it at Target, Walmart, and online. Um, but essentially, it's our take on the popular like kitchen pretend play trend going on right now. My kitchen island does not look anything as nicely laid out as this. <laughs> exactly. And it won't stay this way for long if it's being used right. Um, but we've got a bunch of storage for kids to use. So we've got two shelves of storage for all the pretend play food that you have. And then we've got a butcher block ready for pretend chopping and kind of your layout of whatever foods that they want to play with for the night. So um, it comes with a colander and some tongs so they can get a feel for the tools that you'll use in the kitchen as well. Um, and then over here we've got the taco night. And then pick and sort food groups, which are two examples of the pretend play food that we offer. Sweet. Now you said we have a surprise today. Uh, yes, we do. We have a special guest that's also a huge fan of our Kitchen Island. And his oh, name is... Oh, Snoop. There he is. <laughs> hey, did y'all check out the wheels on this one? What's it? Man, this thing come with wheels, bro. Mark and me come along with this one, it's on like Donkey Kong. I'm going to just have to tell you right now. Three levels. Cutting. What's the sense of leaving the kitchen? <laughs> Why leave when you got all of these? That's right. You exactly. Did? And don't forget on Taco Tuesday, baby, we can teach it all. Look at that. Mm -hmm. So it's in 3D? Look. Exactly. How you liking the show, Snoop? I'm liking it. I might want to stay. Having the best time. Thanks for dropping by, Snoop. So, Macy, let's go through the rest. Yes. Let's go on to uh, Hand to Mine. So, a lot of people are familiar with Number Blocks because there's a popular show that a lot of kids watch, um, and this is one of the sets that is derived from that show. So, here kids can play with Number Blocks character 5 on his superstar stage. It lights up, it's got a bunch of music, sounds, and interactive features. Um, so just like kind of a fun way for kids to watch a show and then also associate a few essential skills and just fun playtime with it. Um, we've also got a huge highlight on sensory and emotional skills right now. So these are our sensory bottles. Each of them offers a new way to engage kids with different liquids of different consistencies. Um, so it's kind of just meant to keep kids focused and engaged or give them a way to cool down if they need it. Um, we've also got a few like social emotional puppets. So oh, we've got different cute. emotions, right? They kind of remind me of Inside Out, which is really big oh, right now. Yeah. Well. yeah. Um, so we've got like your anxiety, happiness, um, disgust, anger, and sadness. So it gives kids something to identify with as they try to express their emotions. These have been my day for the most part today. Yeah. I'm having a good time, but you know, I, I want to be this. But there's a lot of this today. Yeah, I, I feel there's a good amount of the time. Um, and then this also incorporates these same emotions. It's kind of a walk-along. So it's a, Isabella's Day at School is a book that they can read, and then they can hold the emotions throughout the book as they experience them. Oh, okay. um, and as the character experiences them. So it's really cool. Sweet, sweet. And last but not least... Last and not least is Educational Insights. So right now our focus for this brand is on either brain, stem, or crafting toys so as you can see canoodle is one of our biggest selling products this is the latest version it's battery powered and has interactive ways to play so there's a bunch of different puzzles you can do and you can time yourself trying to solve it it's kind of like a physical tetris which is super fun um, it's fun for all ages we say 7 to 107 because you can never be too old for brain games um, and then lastly these are just some of our fun craft kits to get the family together during the holidays or for parties or just like a fun night in so so whether you're bedazzling something or tufting another kit, um, we just want to facilitate creativity and design for kids and, you know, let them imagine.
imagine and let those imaginative thoughts come to life. Really, really cute stuff. How's the show been for you? I don't think I've met you at this show before. You been? I have. I mean, this is my first time here, and it's so fun. From, I mean, the Energizer Bunny is right there. We've got Snoop behind me. Um, this is really <laughs> an interesting event, to say the least. Um, and I love the reception to our products. I feel like we're we're an impactful brand, and we can see the impact come to life. Yeah. It's really great. All right, I'm going to let Macy get back to the business of talking to everybody. So thank you, my <laughs> friends. I appreciate you greatly. All right, hey, dig this. We're going to wrap this one up and say thank you for watching. Uh, from the Toy Insiders Holiday of Play, it's me, it's Ken. See you next time. Bye.